guys, it's me again, and um, there's my cat. She's down there, and then she's coming out the window. Okay. And I'm going to show you how to tack your ears in place. Most of the guys need them tacked. Because the girls, you know, they get weighed down with earrings, but the guys just kind of stick up. So, first, you're going to need um, a thread that matches them. I'm going to put something in here. But, um, you know, this matches him good enough. And you're also going to need the same. You're going to need a yarn needle with a really big thing, a little bit, really big hole, and a match, and a blunt end, pretty much. And also scissors. Okay. Scissors. I'm going to close them. Going to measure them about from ink. There, to about your shoulder. Like, just take it and hold it to about your shoulder. Or so. Okay, and then I'm just going to do that. Uh, so you have five strands. They're about the same length. It doesn't have to be exactly the same length. But just about. You don't want one one inch and another one, you know, a foot. It's probably a foot or two. And if I'm guessing. Okay, so now I have four. One more, you're gonna want five. Heck, oh, here we go. Click the hack. Okay. Let's see if there's something in here. Okay, anyway. So once you have five strands cut, you're going to line them up for the most part, sort of by each other. I'm gonna kind of make them one. And then you're going to take your needle to end with a circle on it. You're going to fold it over so that all the strings are there and you're past the shortest string. Okay? Okay. Good. You're going to hold it there and you're going to slip it off so you have a little loop. Put the loop through the hole and just pull it through. Now I don't want it to get lost or anything so I'm going to tie one knot. And I probably should be moving my room, but I really just need a break for a second, so that's why I'm doing this. Something productive. I'm gonna tie one knot. On the other end, you're also gonna tie some knots. So, when you're doing this, and you're sewing it, you can either go through, you can either cut, do it twice, or you can do it once and just go through him, depending on what you wanna do. Oh my gosh, uh, Okay, tie it, turn it, depending on how big the knot is, we have several knots, make one, try to make one the biggest, it's kind of hard though, it's okay, if you're really good at sewing it's not hard. Okay, once you have a good enough knot, what you're going to do is you're going to um, take a little bit of, this is my first time doing it so don't judge me. Okay, so you're going to take a little bit in the front to make it a little bit of a fur. And then you're going to figure out where you want the ears to be pinned. And you're going to stick it through. Just kind of do that. Eh. There. Just to pin them down. They look kind of sad that way, but. This is not working, hold on, either. sometimes you need to pull it through if you go too far. It's kind of hard doing that, but, you know. Why are you so cat meowing at me, princess? Don't play with the roses. Even though they're dead. They're dead roses. Oh, I probably shouldn't have done that, okay, so. If you do something like this where you go too far, it's okay, just make a really tiny stitch. Go back underneath it, and then go back to where generally started. And Princess, why are you playing with a dead plant? Cat's crazy, I'm sorry. Grr. Dodger's just in the subject, like, kind of like my brah, blah, Can't talk today, whatever. You know. That rat. So, either go through the head and do it again. That sounds really creepy, so. 
She's like, I'm just gonna do that. <laughs> no, I'm just joking, kidding. Okay, so first, I'm going to make little tiny stitches again, just by the um head. And if I see, so that's my friend texting me, I think. Let's see what she said. Yes. I said, I just sent her a picture of my room and said, does it look any different? She's like, yes. So, that was funny. Okay. Just gonna make small stitches. Here. Tiny widow stitches. Just around that area, just to make it tight in. This skin's all lumpy now. Oh, it's just fur. Okay. Fluff that out around there. There we go. It's been the subject of some testing. I'm just gonna go over the head like that because we're gonna cut that later. So then you're just gonna make some more little stitches so that it doesn't come all unraveling over there so that you can cut the string off in the middle. So you don't have to look at it. Yep, sometimes if they have the fur, just fluff it out and it looks a lot better because it does look kind of weird. When the fur gets sewn down, just fluff it out. So those ones really look really weird. I don't know if you see the string across his head. Okay, so then you're gonna tack it down again. About what you think? Should be. I'm just gonna go under it. So you don't see the big string, and I'm gonna go through the bottom layer. Look it through. I'm gonna do it on the other one. Just kind of sewing it. And do way you do. So it's kind of tacked down, so it's ears aren't going all over the place. She looks cute. <laughs> and then don't forget to do your little stitches. You do stitches. And I sewed his ear. There. No, sorry. I sewed it like so it was like this. I'm like, ah! It was a little close to my face, so I'm sorry if you can't see it. I'm just making little stitches right now, so that's what you're gonna do next. If you don't like them, like right there. Can fluff it out, or you can put them under the ear if you really, if you wanted to. Should make be less noticeable. Okay, once you're confident that his their ears are going to stay, you mean less little stitches. You're just going to cut it, snippy snip snip. And then you're going to cut it, this little thing up here, this extra string. Cut that off. If you like these little things on how to fix your napkins and stuff, then please comment you like it and that you, if what you want me to do next I'll try to find out things that has that problem and I'll show you how to fix it easily now his ear came untied because I didn't sew it right because this thread snapped on this one okay, so I'll have to re-sew this one but that's okay because I did not do it right well I did it right but I just um I did not tie it I didn't have to make enough little stitches. You're gonna wanna when you're making the little stitches and I didn't do that. Anyway guys, um you're just gonna wanna make the little many little stitches so that it stays in place. If it doesn't stay in place it's gonna come on down like mine did. Or if you cut it like if you make don't make it a long a tight enough a big enough knot blah, blah, blah. this thing was tied. If it's not, it's gonna come, it's gonna go through when you pull it. That's why you want a big knot. That stays on the surface. Okay, so I'm gonna redo this ear and thanks for watching. Um comment, rate, subscribe. Thread is falling apart. So um, I did it. I snapped it. Comment, rate, and subscribe, and thanks for watching. Give me a thing down so let's look at some pigs. Bye!